Hello, it's Jack here from Lister Skoda in Coventry and it is my turn to do this week's car of the week. Here it is, the Skoda Karak 2 litre diesel DSG 4x4 edition and rather than showing you five features on why you want to buy the car, I'm going to show you nine simply clever Skoda features that you will not find on the spec sheet. Number one, underneath the passenger seat of a Karak you will find an umbrella. Perfect, so you never get caught out in the rain. Number two. Down here in the centre we have some cup holders with bubbles which are designed to grip the bottle to open a drink one-handed and keep you hydrated on those long journeys. Number three. Car park ticket holder. Rather than getting any sticky resin on the windscreen or risk them blowing away, you can just pop it in here, nice and safe. Number four. Rear tables for passengers. Kids are eating their lunch. Nice and secure, nice and sturdy for that. Or having a drink, won't be rolling around. Once they're done with that, probably gonna watch an iPad. Nice and sturdy, watch a film on there. Number five, parcel dividers. Small things in the boot, don't want them moving around. Fix it insecurely there, it ain't going nowhere. Number six, hooks in the boot. Perfect for a Friday night takeaway. One's for you Indian, other one for a Chinese just to make sure that you do not get sweet and sour vindaloo. Number seven, the interior light also acts as a torch. Extremely handy for finding items in the dark on the floor. Or, if you were to have a puncture, replacing a tyre, also magnetic. Number eight, not that you'll need it in this weather, but when winter comes, every year, rather than keeping an ice scraper moving around in the car, nice little handy ice scraper in the fuel cap to scrape all the ice away. And number nine, the practicality of the rear bench. The middle seat can also act as a cup holder for two rear passengers, but also any long items that come through the middle here, you can comfortably get two people in the back still, with also the capability of taking this middle seat out with a couple of seconds, two red clicks there, lift it up, and away you go. So going on a long journey with four passengers, as you can see, you can take the middle seat out. Two rear passengers have much more elbow and shoulder room for the journey ahead. If you don't have any rear passengers in the back, what you can do is take all three individual seats out, making it almost van-like, getting the height and space of fully loading the car. So if you'd like to know anything else about this car, please feel free to give me a call on 02476 686699. Ask myself Jack, where we can take it for a test drive, or discuss more specification.